What's up everyone? I'm the Burning Baron, but you can just call me the Baron. And I'm back with some more Mario Party Superstars because I just really love this game and I want to keep playing it for a bit. And thought might as well make some more videos on it. Um, I am going to play up against Master CPUs this time around because I have not done that yet. And I thought, why not give myself the challenge? I've been playing against hard CPUs this whole time. So, let's find it. Let's go take on some uh, Master CPUs this time around. So, I'm uh, planning a little thing, something a little different for this video. I am going to do a 20 turn game, but I'm going to try and break it up into four parts. So that maybe the length is a little more reasonable. Alright. So, we'll see how that works. I'll get my original squad going. Or my personal squad. My OG squad with my brother is with Wario instead of Daisy. And I'm gonna put them all on the master. And then as for the board, I went to Spaceland in my first video. I'm gonna go with my second favorite. I'm gonna go with Woody Woods this time around. I'll go with the OG bonus stars. All types of mini games. Alrighty, let's head into it. What I will probably do is I will probably make each video like five turns long. Maybe. We'll see how long it takes for me to finish five turns. This could be either like. Maybe this will even be just two videos. Depends. But let's see how long it takes for me to finish five turns. And hopefully it'll be a decent amount of time to call it a video. The once in a lifetime chance. No, once in a millennium. I see what you did there. I absolutely love most of the callbacks in this game. This game, as of the recording this, this game has been out for about a week now. And I have not put it down since because it's just... I absolutely love it. Uh, this is not my first time playing this board. I know this board very well at this point and I'm going last beautiful perfect that's just screw that all right I can make this work I can make this work there are some benefits to going last not very many mind you but there are still some benefits like, I've learned that you can base- if with a custom dice block, you can basically manipulate what type of minigame will pop up at the end of the turn by just- because like, if you don't- first, like, let's say you got one of your opponents right in front of the star and they can afford it if they win the next minigame. If you land on a space that pairs you up with a different CPU and you beat them, well, that just lowers the chances of them winning in like a 1v3 or a- oops, a four player minigame. Also, Luigi getting a Chomp Call first turn. Oh, we... CPUs are really annoying with Chomp Calls, 100%. Need to think of banter ideas already. We are like less than five minutes into this video and I'm already too quiet. Everyone's got items. Oh, okay, well, DK doesn't, but... I would very much like item from a space. Oh, ne oh, sure, now I get a 10. Um... Ooh. I guess I'm gonna have to... Yeah, I'm gonna have to go up, because it's gonna lead me in the wrong direction if I go the other way. But, at least I'm getting an item. Hmm. I very much like that custom dice block. Let's see if I can get it. Yes! Oh, what timing. I'll take it. That's, um, that's some good space manipulation. Well, not really manipulation, I guess. It's, it, it's good. It's a good item. It's definitely one of Super Mario Party's better items. So powerful. Oh my... Okay, so there's a little bit of a fun fact about this minigame. I've played it seven times and I've not won it yet. 
and I just don't know how the CPUs manage to hide so fast. Oh my goodness, this is going to be absolutely destructive. I'm definitely not going to win this. Yeah, see? I don't know how they do it. I, I took my hand off the control stick, but I was still moving. And so were they. I don't understand how this minigame works. You guys are cheating so hard. Don't even at me. I could- I let go of that control stick immediately and I still- I just kept moving. Ugh. I hated how I got this minigame first of all things. Cause I was like- I was thinking before I recorded this, I'm like, if Sneak and Snore pops up, I'm not going to win that minigame. It was like, no shot. Alright. So I can make it to the other side from here. But so can everybody else, except for maybe Daisy. Yeah. Sounds about right. I need to be careful though. If I get too close, Luigi's just gonna send it flying. Not like anyone's gonna make it this turn anyway. Like, if I get a perfect 10, I'll make it, but I don't really plan. I'm hoping not to get a perfect 10. Because then I'm just gonna land on a red space. And I'm not gonna be able to afford the star. Oh wait, she can't make it from here regardless, because there's 22 left, and she can't get anything higher than a 20. Not that she did, she got like less than a 10. Alright. I do not want to use my item just yet. Alright, everyone getting some small numbers. Ooh, I'll take this lucky space. I'll take another custom dice block, perfect. That, that, that works out for me. I like it. Alright, which one of these can I actually- well, let's- okay, well this one I don't think I can actually win, but I have a better shot at this than I do at, uh, Sneak and Snore of all things. Alright, if there's anything I've learned, it's just keep putting them down and hoping that a combo comes around. Do that. Do that. Do that. Oh, someone's out at two points. Oh my goodness. Also, they're already dropping so much shit on my screen. Oh hell yeah, that's what I'm talking about, but Luigi's already kicking our asses. Oh, look, Daisy's already won. Yeah. Okay, I don't know how they did that so fast. I I love how Daisy had 101 points in a matter of, like, a few seconds, and DK was out at two points in a few seconds. Alright, so I think minigames are going to prove to be very challenging this time around. I have an idea on how I'm going to possibly get that star. So Luigi's bypassed it. I need to get a- I'm going to use one of my custom dice blocks to get a relatively small number. Well, actually, I don't think anything can really save me. I think no matter how close I get, Luigi's just going to use his whistle anyway. And it's good to know that they've all bypassed the star anyway. Well, regardless, I think I'll use one of my custom dice blocks to hit that lucky space up ahead. You just see how far away it is? It's four spaces away. Because knowing, I know, knowing Luigi, he will use that cust that uh, chomp whistle next turn, because he'll know I can reach the star from here. I am not going to buy anything. So... He will use it, but I can still use my custom dice block to get 
Like, a decently good event space, maybe. Like, probably hit Woody up there. Alright, can we win if I'm paired up with the other CPUs? Squared Away is a nice mini game. It's hard for the three people because they move so slow. But it's also panic inducing for the solo player. Come on, guys. Corner him. Oh, for guys! Come on, we got this. Luigi, you fucking doorknob. Guys, oh my goodness, Lu how come you guys are so intelligent on your own, but you're so terrible with me? Maybe CPUs do throw the game on your uh, on your behalf, or throw it f because they're with you. Who knows? I I recently saw a video that suggests that maybe CPUs can cheat, or they're just really 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 smart and they kind of gang up against you. Alright, Luigi. Let's see you do it. Let's see you do it. Oh, he didn't do it! You fool. And I don't even think DK can reach it from where he is, if I'm correct. Wait, maybe... Oh, no, he can't. Because the maximum he can get with this is a 15. Wait, he probably could have reached it from there. Why did it say 13 to the star? Yeah, something. I, I don't think that's pretty accurate because he totally could have reached that on a 13. You'd think she would have done that, because, like, they bought- I feel like they all know I'm right there. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I- I was getting the star position mixed up. I thought it was right in front of the woody tree. I didn't- I forgot it's not there. It's a little bit after. So I guess I can't reach it from where I'm at. That's- that's why he didn't use it. Also, this is problematic, because I haven't won a minigame yet. Now I'm about to lose seven coins. Alright, I need something... Um, maybe? Alright, well, let's see how this goes. Oh, come on. Okay, yeah, no, I'm not winning this. I can already tell you I'm not winning this. I've wiped out twice, and they haven't wiped out once. Okay, Master CPUs are going to prove to be very difficult. Oh my goodness, why am I wiping out so frequently? Yeah, I've already lost this. Well, I guess I'm going to use the I'm going to use Woody just to get some money here because I need five more coins. No, oh, four more coins. Oh my, yeah, these guys are already going to prove to be very hard. All right. Oh, wait a minute. Hold up, wait, I'm, I'm smarter than this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. If I land, oh, that's nine. If I land there, I can get another, oh, yeah, eight. If I land there, I can get another dice block and hopefully get higher than a two. Oh, but I don't have enough points. That's why. Okay, well, I guess. I just hope for the best, and hope that the star ends up 
Still close to me when Luigi uses that fucking whistle. Oh, I got 12 coins this time? I... Okay, yeah, yeah, in the original, I got... We got five from me hitting that. I'll take this, this generous donation. Okay, Storm Chasers. This is actually a minigame I'm really good at. So here's hoping that I can still beat Master CPUs in this game. Come on. Need to ex I need to prove that I'm still good at this game. Out of my way, you stupid moles and you stupid CPUs. I'm winning this one. Come on. Come on. Yes! Yes! I continue to prove I'm good at this game. <laughs> Storm Chasers has always been one of my best minigames. Even in the original, in Top 100. I lost, like, recently I lost once to Mark, but I don't win lose that minigame often. If at all. So. I'll play this turn. Now I'll call it for this part one. Yep. Saw that coming. Please warp just below me to like so that I can just go down. Warp somewhere within my vicinity, please. Not what I was hoping for. That is far from my vicinity. In fact, DK is literally right there. Yeah, I kind of saw that coming. If I if I did not lose all that money, I could have gotten that star. Yes. All right. Well, I guess. No, well, maybe if DK gets this right here, maybe it'll go. No, he's not. This chump can't get a higher no high enough number. Hmm. No, I kind of need to hope for a relatively small number. What you getting? What's this eight getting you? Oh, it's an item space. Okay, that makes sense. A hundred percent makes sense. And you didn't get anything. Sucker. All right, low roll. It's not a low roll, but okay. Blue space. Where will a 9 get me? 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, well, boring turn either way, so I'm gonna go down. Um... I like movement, so I'm gonna go with the mushroom. Because maybe if Luigi curses me, I can deny that with uh, a mushroom. Ooh, bonus minigame. And I'm up against everybody, so this is going to be hard. Okay, please be the tower one. Okay, well, they oh, they all just started barreling toward me. Okay, so these CPUs just don't want me alive. Well, screw you guys for actually targeting me. Yeah! That's what I thought. Get in there. All right, let's pull it back. So it was a very it's a relatively rough beginning, but I've now won two mini games. I'm in first with 58 coins. Let's see how long I can keep this up. I will see you guys in the next video.